It's week two in Serie A this weekend. We've got five head-to-heads out of the ten fixtures to predict. See who gets closer this time. Ali, I'm going to start with AC Milan against New Boys Brescia. You assume that Milan is going to be better. And it's not going to take much to be better. This is a team that had, you know how many shots on target last game against Udinese? Yeah, yeah, search hard. Zero. They're going to get more than zero. Maybe score a couple of goals. How about it? Milan at home. I'll take them. Yeah. Against his old team, Gianpaolo, uh, Balotelli's there, uh -huh. against his old team. Okay, yeah. Win -win, yeah. Okay. You need to sort out the formation. My goodness. Is that what's they, happening? They were atrocious last week. Yes, they were. Juventus against Napoli. Big game. Big early game in the season and big early statement that can be made from both teams. I still think that Juventus at their best. They are superior to Napoli. Napoli will push, they'll huff and puff, they'll create some opportunities, but they don't have the guy that's going to score the decisive goal. Juventus does. Juventus wins. I'm excited to see Douglas Costa and Higuain supporting Cristiano Ronaldo. I think Juventus will have enough, even though I do love me some Napoli. Mm. Uh, Lazio against Roma. You know, <laughs> the difficulty about both of these teams is neither can defend all that well. But when you have both of them that can't really defend, I have to look, okay, well, who's superior in the attack? Roma is superior to Lazio in the attack. And yet, I just don't trust Roma defensively. I'm going to take Lazio. Their defense is a catastrophe. Uh, they each won one of these fixtures last year, quite dominantly as well. Lazio getting the better of Roma in the most recent one. Lazio on a high after mm. their win over Sampdoria. Cagliari against Inter. Oh, Lukaku is a solution. And Nainggolan at Cagliari. No, no. Well, okay, whatever. Lukaku is the solution. We are good. Everything is great. He's fantastic. Lukaku! Antonio Conte. The renaissance. The career that, would, that never was in Manchester United takes off at Inter. Yes, sir. Lukaku and Inter win away from home. They will win away from home, despite losing there last year because Cagliari are missing some big players for them. Pavel Wait, but Nangolan and Cagliari. Thanks. Oh, but they do have Nangolan. Yeah, thanks, thanks for that. Uh, Atalanta uh, at home, back in Bergamo against Torino. On a high after making the Champions League group stages where they will face Manchester City. <laughs> Is that a high? <laughs> that's kind of, to be honest, that's kind of a low. But Atalanta, I'm going to say just enough over Torino, even though it breaks my heart because, you know, I have some Venezuelan blood over there at Torino with Tomás Rincón. However, I'm taking Atalanta. I think it's a draw. I think they'll just be a little bit rusty. They came back well last weekend, but I think Torino, decent side, got a good win last week. And I think they'll get a draw. So let us know, as always, your predictions. Let's see how we fare. Week two. <sighs> Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.